guys this is marina at better booties online training today's videos content will be for training phase one day three and that's a back workout okay so training just in case you missed my previous videos there's three different training phases when you want to compete i have uploaded already i think three videos three training days so this program consists of a five day a week split program and this is for training phase one you need to maintain this for at least four weeks, longer if you're a beginner, and this creates overall muscle balance and builds a foundation for you to then shift your workout to, to phase two. This is ideal for beginners or for advanced exercisers. It, it makes no difference whatsoever. Everyone should stick to this program as closely as possible for desired results. Obviously, if you haven't got full access to a gym or certain exercises, um, so, sorry, certain machines, then please leave a comment down below and I'll be happy to give you variations. <laughs> First exercise is pull-ups. As you can see, this is not an easy exercise, especially if you are a beginner. So I would recommend you use an assisted pull-up machine if you have access to one, bands, or even someone to help spot you. You should perform four sets to failure. This means as many reps as possible times four. Exercise two is a squat deadlift. Try and think of the movement as a regular deadlift, but keep your stance wide so you can sit back into a deep squat as you lower bar toward floor. Perform five sets, starting with 15 reps for set one, and rest for 40 seconds, add weight and decrease reps to every set. Exercise three is a wide grip lat pull down. Focus on keeping your chest tall and your elbows pointing down. Contract your muscles as you bring bar to under chin or upper chest position. Complete five sets in total. Again, starting with 15 reps. Add weight and decrease reps for each set. Fourth exercise is a one-arm Smith machine row. Stand to the side of the Smith machine, holding the bar with palm facing in, keeping your knees bent slightly, hinge your hips and lower upper body, keeping back straight. Make sure to row bar, keeping elbow tight and close to the body. Perform four sets of eight reps per side. Make sure you use a heavy weight so you can only perform eight reps. Exercise five is a T-bar row. If you haven't got access to a T-bar machine, you can lock one end of the barbell into a landmine or secured on the floor. Perform four sets, starting with 12 reps, add weight and decrease reps for every set. Exercise six is a good old fashioned good morning. Stick chest out, maintaining an arch in your lower back at all times. Lower the bar to about a 45 to 60 degree angle before returning back to standing position. Perform 10 reps of three sets. Yeah. 
Last but not least, cable rope pull through, stand away from the cable stack set to the lowest position, holding the ends of the rope with both hands, feet slightly wider than shoulders, lean forward, bending knees while keeping back flat and abs tight. Stand and pull rope through legs by squeezing glutes, but do not push hips forward at the end position. Senya struggles with this movement. She finds this difficult and her form is not 100%. So I will show you a set of pull throughs with good technique and form. I hope you enjoyed our back workout. All information regarding reps, sets and loads will be in the description below.